So tell, tell me a bit more about your, your career. Yeah. 12 years in now, just pretty much riding. So, um, yeah. yeah. Works very hard at his bike riding. Um, but, yeah, what he does, does attract young, beautiful girls and they're hanging off him. Dad's starting to throw bombs straight away. I'm thinking, what are you doing, mate? Give me a break. In saying that, Renee, I think I'd like to take you um, to have a chat one-on-one. -on -one. Why not? Let's okay. do it. Oh, See oh, you later. Nice. Yeah, you're in trouble. <laughs> and then he just grabs Renee. I'm left there sitting with her grandparents going, how do I get out of this one? Um, I want to touch base on where Dad picked up with that because um, obviously being in the industry I'm with um, and the girls that come with that, there is a lot of situations that you get put in where you do run into problems if your partner's insecure, yeah. um, if there's trust issues, etc. And just, just reflecting on that, that's been some of the issues in her past relationships sure. and sadly guys have taken advantage of her, you know, and, and, that, and that, that that's really, that's hurt her. Yeah. You know, what yeah. kind of reassurance do we have that the same thing wouldn't happen with uh, you? That you won't go running around with all these dolly birds that yeah. follow you? Very simple answer for me. I'm a very loyal person, and when I'm in a relationship, I have nothing but respect for that person. Renate means a lot to me, and you have 100% trust that I'll never do anything to hurt her. You do not even have to worry about that. Yeah, gentleman's agreement. Yeah, 100%. Yeah. No, that's, that's the kind of reassurance that, that we really need for her. Yeah. He felt genuine, you know, yeah, yes, I would trust him. You know, I think they've got prospects. Matt has surprised me. He thinks and cares a lot about you at this short time. He's got feelings no, no. for you, Renee. Yeah. He's got big feelings. Ooh, that's how I'm getting a bit emotional yeah. myself. Um, shit. I want to make sure Renee has got all the right intentions. And the biggest concern would be whether Renee's still got any feelings for ex-boyfriend Kieran. Um, I don't want to see him with his heart broken, obviously. Yeah. Matt's been split up from a long-term relationship for a while now. Um, yours is very fresh. Yeah. Um, obviously, the subject's going to come up, Kieran. Um, everything's gone for Kieran. Um, being in paradise with your ex is super difficult. Um, yes. But as soon as Matt came into paradise, it was actually like my paradise actually started. Okay. And it's been good ever since. Yeah. I'm very happy. Like, I didn't think I could be this happy. Uh, but getting back to Kieran, I know, harping on about this. Yeah. Are you completely over Kieran? know that I'm fresh out of a relationship. Yeah. But if I didn't want to be here, if Matt, I wouldn't be here. And Matt right now is what I want. I can see they both have mutual feelings for each other, but I felt like she didn't tell me what I wanted to hear, that she's over, Kieran. And as a parent, I am concerned. Matt's heart could be broken. Um, so we'll have to see. You're probably wondering what's going through my head. Yeah, definitely. I am very surprised to see you, Matt, that you're falling for Renee. Yeah. It's, and that's great, yeah. that's a good thing. But I'm a little bit concerned because I asked the questions. Obviously, I drilled her about um, Kieran, and I felt like she didn't tell me what I wanted to hear, that she's over Kieran. I am a little bit rattled that he thinks Renee might not be over Kieran yet. Obviously, as your father, I don't want to see you, you know, um, heartbroken. Yeah, yeah. After having a chat with my dad, I have a lot on my mind. Yeah, just look after yourself. Right See you later. See you later. All the best, Matt. Thank you.